Hey, thanks for coming by. I'm here to talk about how to get into one of my favorite poses, Malasana, and make it more accessible with using a block. These blocks in yoga are gonna be useful for those who just need a little added support and um, help with balance and flexibility. So these can help you kind of feel either more intense of a stretch or just be there as a support to ease into the stretch. So Malasana um, without a block is coming feet hip width distance apart, toes pointed outward, and then you will sink the hips back and down to the earth. You should fall naturally right away if this does not feel good you do what's best for your body and honor that but have the arms come between the thighs and you may hear your teacher cue to prayer the palms together this is what this looks like and push through the forearms to further open up the hip area sink and lift from the base of the spine to the crown of the head when you're here be here breathe be still and enjoy the sensations and all this brings. If using a block, you might slip that block this way, right under those hips to let the glutes fall back. You may be able to spread the legs further and push them open wider with the forearms. You may also do revolved squat here, placing one hand down. Inhale, lifting the other hand up, sending your gaze with it, opening up that side body. Exhale back down, do the same thing on the other side. One palm down on the ground, inhale the other arm up, send the gaze with it. Exhale back down. As you finish, you slowly take that block out from underneath you and come back to a seated position. Um, something to kind of cleanse the hips afterwards would be to windshield wiper the legs, bring one leg down, and then the other. Just adding small movements, small sensations. I hope you enjoy Malasana. Let me know if the block helps it be more accessible to you. Um, like, comment, subscribe. I appreciate you being here with me. Thank you.